Brock Eagles taking on third-ranked Mount Vernon in a 3A Division I state semifinal. Down 7-0, the Eagles tie things up. Tyler Moody throwing across the middle to Elijah Potts. That's a 17-yard Brock touchdown, and we're tied at 7. The Tigers answer back. Rafe Ramsey. Well, they're trying to answer back because he makes the catch, but Reed Watkins just rips it out. He's going the other way. Usually it's called a scoop and score. That's a give me the football, and I'm just going to go score play. Rock up 21-7 at the half. Mount Vernon will score three unanswered touchdowns in the third quarter, though. Mackenzie McGill going in from two yards out. The Tigers up 28-21 after three. Late in the fourth now. Eagles put together a five-minute, 12-play, 84-yard drive capped off by Potts on the jet sweep going in from 20 yards out. We are tied at 28, and we are headed to overtime. In OT, Brock going first with the football. Nathan Jones reports as eligible, lining up at center. He snaps it, waits for everybody to go right, and then breaks to the left and is wide open. The Eagles take the 35-28 lead. Now it's Mount Vernon's turn. Fourth down. Their quarterback, last chance, Braden Bennett, back to pass, throws it up. It's intercepted by Brock's Carson Finney, and that punches Brock's ticket to the state championship. They win 35-28, and for that goal line stand, the Brock Eagles get this week's title belt. It was a game the Eagles will never forget. It was amazing. We needed a challenge to get ready for the state game, and I knew this Mount Vernon team would come and bring it to us. Oh, man, it was a dog fight. It was the most fun game I've ever played in my life. I've been waiting since I was five years old, dreaming of a moment like this. It was amazing.